Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you so much one more time for tuning in to OnStopFate.com where we walk by faith, we talk faith, <laughs> we live by faith because that's our duty as faith walkers, believers, and talkers. Glory be to God. Thank you for tuning in to this channel. A quick word. Again, we're dealing with seeking God. Now we're at Jeremiah 29 and verse 13 it says and he shall seek me and find me when he shall search for me with all your heart i am going to read it again and he shall seek me and find me when he shall search for me with all your heart hallelujah what a word from god i'm just so excited this is very serious brothers and sisters that we seek after God for such a time as this corona on the land so many things are happening but when you seek after the true God I'm talking about the God of Israel the God of Abraham the God of Isaac the God of Joseph the God of Moses hallelujah the God who passed the Red Sea what a God if you seek after the true God the God of Israel Jesus is the only way the true the son of God if you don't have Jesus my brothers and my sisters you're missing out on the promise of God I'm not talking about just gaining the things of this world because why gain this world and lose your soul the greatest gain you can ever gain is to have Jesus on the inside hallelujah but seeking God Seek God, my brothers and sisters. That's the most important thing. And when you seek, ye shall find. When you knock, the door is going to be open. When you ask, hallelujah, I am telling you, you are about to receive a breakthrough like never before if Jesus just enter your vessel. I am telling you, if you just take heed, hallelujah, of the word that is coming to you right now through YouTube, that is coming to you right now over social media, I am telling you, God want to do something greater in your life, but you got to seek him. You got to you got to get out of your comfort zone. Hallelujah. You you got to position yourself right now because the storm is blowing. So many things are happening. Hallelujah. And the boat is rocking all over. My God. But only if you have Jesus in the vessel, you can weather any storm. Only if Jesus is your anchor, you can stand, be still, and know that he is God. What am I saying to you right now? You need Jesus. Holly, every day I need him. Hallelujah. You see this joy that I'm experiencing? It's like, hallelujah, water, glory be to God. As the word declared, decree, it's like, you know, water rivers running out of your belly, overflow with joy. The joy of the Lord is my strength. I can go on and on and on and on. I'm just, I don't want to keep him for myself. <laughs> I don't want to keep the joy of the Lord for myself. I want you to receive it. I want you to experience the love of God for the rest of your life. Stop wasting your time and accept Jesus. Don't go around in circles, my brothers and my sisters. Enough is enough. Let us seek God together. Let's go after God with all our heart, our mind, our body, our soul. Because now is the time, my brothers and my sisters, that we shake up our folly grounds. And we say, you know what? Enough is enough. I'm no longer going to be a slave to sin. Oh, no. Enough is enough. Let us seek God, my brothers and sisters. This is version two, part two, whatever you want to call it, of this video. We're doing a series on seeking God. So stay tuned. Hit the subscribe button and the notification bell because I'm going to send up more as the Lord lead me. I'm going to send up more videos and seeking God because I believe right now, my brothers and my sisters, now is the time for us to seek God like never before. And remember now, we continue to walk by faith and not by sight. I'll see you on the next video coming out and seeking God. God bless you until we meet again in Jesus' name. Walk by faith.
Thank you.